don't you pterodactyls leave us alone? And why are they so hungry? Back at their home, what do wild pterodactyls like to eat? I've seen them eat those floating flowers in the creek. Vanilli pads. That's right. So if we go collect a big old bunch of vanilli pads, we can use them to lure the taros away from Dino Ranch. That could work. Dino Ranchers, ride! Yeehaw! Okay. All we have to do is wait here and scoop up the vanilli pads when they float past. I hope our hats are big enough for all of them. <laughs> That's strange. What happened to all the vanilli pads? Yeah, there's usually lots of them. What could have stopped them from floating on the... Uh-oh. It's because of the dam. Look at all the vanilli pads. The creek usually takes them downstream, but now they're stuck. No wonder those taros are so hungry. Our dam has stopped them from eating their favorite food. Building a dam was a bad idea. It was a good idea for the baby Brontos, but not so good for the pterodactyl. No, it wasn't, Miguel. It was a great idea. Our Brontosaur herd loves this big watering hole. We have to think of a way to keep the dam and let the vanilli pads float down to the pterosaurs. And we will. I've got an idea. <laughs> You're so smart. Now the vanilli pads can keep floating to the pterodactyls, and the baby brontos can still drink from the stream. <laughs> Come on, let's welcome them back to their home. <laughs> Come home, pterosaurs. Your vanilli pads are back. Look, here they We have to get the tin horns out. I got here first, Dino Ranchers. This mine is mine! <laughs> oh no! The walls are cracking! They could crumble and fall any second! We need to get out! Nuh-uh! You're not tricking us into leaving our emeralds behind! Yeah! This cave is perfectly safe. No, it's not safe. We have to get out of here. All of us. <laughs> Quit running, Ike. Do you want us to save you or not? <laughs> yes, please. Mommy, I'm trying to help. Pull them up ourselves. Uh, uh, Bobby, you have to let go of the emerald. It's too heavy. Goodbye, shiny rock. Come on, Clara. We have to go. Quit trying to save me. I don't want to be saved. I want emeralds. On second thought, Emeralds? She thinks I want one. Tango, I don't need emeralds. 
I just need to get us all safely out of here. And we need to get out fast. Oh, Dino Ranchers! With tricks like that, Terra's air show is gonna be incredible! Thanks, John. We want our grand opening to be super special. Thanks for coming early to help set up. A Dino Rancher always answers a call for help, especially from a friend. Terra! Hey, Dad! Terra! I've got some bad news. Sonny the Kid was spotted heading this way. Sonny the Kid, the trickiest dino wrestler this side of Dinorado. He's big trouble. He's always trying to rustle dinosaurs. He must have heard the airport is opening and wants to take one of our pterosaurs for himself. Not while we're around. Clover and I can stand guard. We'll keep Sunny from ruining your special day. Thanks, Min. When it comes to good friends, the Dino Ranchers are sky high. Here we are. Splinter, feast your eyes on the Dino Airport! Look at all those amazing pterosaurs! I must have one! That will prove that I, Sunny the Kid, am the greatest Dino Wrestling Mastermind of all time! <laughs> What's this? <laughs> they think they can keep me out? This will be too easy. Just the way I like it. Onward, Splinter! Hop to, hop to! Come on, Clover. We have to stay focused if we want to catch that no good rustler. <laughs> Intruder alert! Clover, charge! Whoa! Oh! Sorry, Mom, Pa. Clover and I thought you were Sonny the Kid. We're guarding the airport. Sonny the Kid? <laughs> The dino rustler? Well, if he shows his face around here, you sure are ready for him. And it's very kind of you to miss the air show to help Tara. <gasps> miss the air show? I hadn't thought about that. Well, let's get along, y'all. We sure fire don't want to miss the show. Absolute and tootly. It's gonna be an amazing sight to see. <laughs> Sorry, Clover. We have to stay here and watch for Sunny. I know. I don't want to miss the show either. Look! It's our new neighbor! Great thundering dinosaurs! Look at her go! Yeehaw! I've never seen anyone ride a pterodactyl before. Howdy, neighbors! I'm Tara, and this here's my pterodactyl pal, Wilbur. <laughs> it's great to meet you, Tara. I'm John. This is my sister, Min, and my brother, Miguel. And this is Blitz, Tango, and Clover. <laughs> We're the Dino Ranchers. Well, it sure is a pleasure to meet y'all. Wilbur and I have brought a special delivery for you. <laughs> Our sky-high cherry pie. <laughs> It's our gift to you, our new neighbors. <gasps> oh, gee, thanks, Tara. That's mighty kind of you. We love your gift. <laughs> I can see that. Sorry we can't stay longer, but we have to gather a whole lot of hay for our fleet of flying Taros back home. And let me tell you, pterosaurs love lots and lots of hay. Hi, yo, Wilbur! Giddy up, up, and away! nice of Tara to give us such a great gift. <gasps> yeah, it would have been nice to have tasted some of it. Yeah, 
we should return the favor with something just as great. And I know exactly what to give her. This is a great idea, John. Tara's gonna be so surprised when we arrive with this big gift of fresh hay for her pterodactyls. Like Tara said, pterosaurs love lots and lots of hay. And I love being a good neighbor. Ah! Uh-oh, wild pteranodons. Hey, you can't take our hay. It's a gift for our new neighbor. No, you don't. Oh. Yeehaw! You tell him, Clover. Vamanos, Tango! Let's go! Yeah, yeah! hurt to watch for a little bit. Right, Clover? Look, Splinter. She's distracted. I'll sneak past her, no problem. Smell something, Clover? Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> P.U. I knew I should have had a bath today. For my next amazing trick, I need a volunteer from the audience to ride in Wilbur's Dino Porter. A volunteer for the show? <gasps> oh, pick me! Pick me! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Wait, I can't leave. I need to watch out for Sunny. Stop you, tricky rustler. <laughs> I think not. I've still got some more tricks up my sleeve. <laughs> Where did he go? Oh no. I can't believe I let Sunny get past us. Quick, Clover, we have to tell the others. We've got an outlaw on the loose. Yay! Woohoo! John, Miguel, Sunny the kid is hiding somewhere in the airport. Oh no! He got past you? Yeah. I only looked away for one teeny second. That Sunny is even trickier than we thought. We better find that sneaky rustler. show. All right, let's find that slippery Sunny. No distractions, stay focused. <whistles> Dino Ranchers, ride! ride! Oh no, they're coming back. What's going on over there? Let's go check it out. I can't see where I'm going. Whoa! Where are they? <gasps> Incoming! They took the whole wagon and all the terrors hay! Hey there, Dino Ranchers. We heard a loud ruckus. What happened here? Two pteranodons flew down and took a wagon full of hay. We need to get your hay back. Er, uh, um, uh, I mean our hay. We need to get our hay back. Getting it back won't be easy. 
Those wild taros live way up on top of Mile High Mesa. No problem. Climb aboard. You mean you'll fly us there? You bet your boots we will. Helping your friends is what a good neighbor is all about. Woohoo! Yeah! Yeah! Right. Hang on to your hats, ranchers. Hi, yo, Wilbur! Giddy up, up, and away! What a view! I've never seen anything like this. It's so beautiful. I can't believe we get to live here. We're the luckiest kids alive! Wild pteranodons usually keep close to their home. Tara, have you ever seen them steal hay like that before? Nope, but like I said, pterosaurs love lots and lots of hay. Miguel, can you see anything with your dinoculars? Yes, there's the wagon. See? Yup, there it is, all right. But there's no way we can get to it without those pteranodons seeing us. Well, we didn't come all this way to give up now. I've got an idea. Wilbur and I will get those taros to follow us while you load your hay back into the wagon. Then we'll fly on back and pick Ell up. Easy as sky high cherry pie. That's a great plan, but only if it works. Let's fly, Wilbur. It's time for some high flying distraction action. Your hay. Try and catch us if you can. There goes Tara, and there go the pteranodons. Now's our chance. 